So today we're here at the Kennedy Space Center and uh, they have three different viewing locations that you could get here. Uh, two of them actually cost money, one does not. So if you're going to visit Kennedy during a launch time, right by where they have uh, the Atlantis shuttle stored, uh, you can actually go and watch for free the shuttle launch. Or they have another location uh, it's a $20 fee. It sells out fairly quickly and they bus you to this other location that's about five miles away. What we're about to do today is the LC, uh, what is it? 39. One more time. 39. Yes, the LC 39. So what's really nice about this launch site is that it's about three and a half miles away. So I'm not sure how loud that's going to be, but we are definitely going to find out. But we are going to have the very best view of the launch that you can get here at the Kennedy Space Center. This is the lovely bus that they're taking us to the launch site in. Yes, and it's properly air conditioned. We're actually on our way to the launch site. Uh, so, I mentioned earlier how close we're going to be. Actually, we're uh, just under three miles. Uh, it's like somewhere around two and a half miles from the actual rocket itself. This is the closest that they ever allow anyone to be during a launch. So, this is going to be very, very exciting. Uh, can't wait. So I'm going to film uh, the bus ride over uh, to the lunch site and uh, I don't know, we'll see how it is. Now the viewing area here at Candy Space Center is right over there by um, the uh, shuttle and its booster. That building holds uh, Atlanta and to the left is a viewing area for Rocketeer and that's free to be at. Um, and then there's two pay locations. Uh, one for $20 and then one for about $50. And we're going to the $50 one. <laughs> Alright, we finally arrived. We're over here at L. C 39A. This is a launch facility. Now what's really interesting about that is in the distance you can see uh, four little towers out there and it, we're really close uh, to where the actual launch is. This is as close as anyone can get to watch if you're a civilian. How far away are we? We're 2.3 miles from the launch. Behind me over here is uh, SpaceX and uh, the SpaceX building over here and uh, that's where they launched theirs but they don't allow you to watch it from here. <laughs> it's too close. So we're actually on the fourth floor of this building and we're able to actually get this fantastic view. If you look behind me, got a lot of people here getting ready to watch this launch. We're about an hour out of the launch. Just, yeah, just me. Thanks. I guess. So how many launches have you guys watched? Hundreds. Hundreds. <laughs> and, and the fact that you said it in unison is uh, the, the epic part right My there. My earliest went with Skylab. Oh, really? That was a little bit of time ago. Yeah. <laughs> so was I. <laughs> so can someone describe to me what this, uh, what the bottle is? Is it aluminum? Is it plastic? Yeah, that's what, what I was wondering. It's a, some sort of alloy. I think it's aluminum. Yeah, but I think so. The only thing I, 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 I love the Atlas V part on it. Okay, maybe I, it I think it. I'm gonna put a NASA logo right over there. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Cool. Care instructions. It is BPA free. BPA free. But 
So this is uh, our, our our gift for uh, attending the launch today. Gluten free. That's the closest I've ever been to a rocket launch and it was amazing, absolutely epic. Uh, it actually hurt to look at the rocket because the flame was so bright. Um, how amazing, how amazing. I would absolutely do this again. So cool, so very cool. <laughs> 